and welcome to my channel, Andrew Makes. It is Monday, December 6th, so let's move the star. I did move the star this weekend, but I didn't open my sewing advent calendar over the weekend because I wanted to wait and do that with you guys. So let's open Saturday, Sunday, and today's advent calendar gift. So the fourth was... Saturday. Let's see what's in there. A thimble. The classic silver thimble. Let's see what is behind the fifth, which was Sunday, yesterday. It is a threader in the shape of a butterfly. Super cute. Okay, and today, number six, right here. Let's see what's in there. It's a frog, but I'm not sure what it is. Let me read on the back. Oh, it's a tape measure. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Okay, wait, here's the frog. And then here's the tape measure part. So cute! I'm glad they have explanations on the back. Tonight for dinner, I am having, I'm using this cookbook. It's the Wholesome Yum Easy Keto Cookbook by Maya Kromp. And tonight I am having 15 minute egg roll in a bowl. Super yummy. I've made this before. And this is one of my questions for you today. Do you meal plan? Every week before I go to the grocery store, I sit down with my cookbooks and my grocery list and I decide what I'm going to make that week and then I make my grocery list from those meals. So let me know if you are a meal planner. That's one of our questions today. And what I'd like to share today are my sewing plans for the I'm So Festive challenge that's being run on Instagram. It's I'm S-E-W Festive. It's being hosted by Simply Delilah, Kim Gaddy Sews, and One Lisa Show. And the idea is to get some novelty fabric and make a garment. It doesn't have to be for you. It can be pajamas for kids or anything like that. I want you to use novelty fabric, which is super fun. And I'm planning on making McCall's 6730. This top, and I'm going to make view C. Love the sleeves. As you can see, it's dropped right here, and then it has this fun bottom sleeve part, and then it has this really fun across the bottom bodice also. And there's the other views of the pattern if you're interested. And here are the line drawings from the instruction sheet. It's easier to see than the back of the pattern envelope, I think. And here's the front of view C, and then the back of view C. And we're gonna have a lot of fun making that. I'm going to wait to show you my fabric because I want it to be a surprise. But I do want to show you some novelty fabric that I have used in the past. I really like novelty fabric. I think it's a lot of fun. Here's a desktop cube I made. This is a pattern by So Sweetness. And I use this fun fox fabric. Which I think is fun. Then I also made this laptop bag for my laptop, and I used these retro telephones. I thought that was really fun for a laptop bag. And then another novelty fabric I've used is in this skirt. This is the No Zip Skirt by Blue Dot Patterns, and I have a sew-along on my channel for how to make this if you're interested. It's really great for beginners, but you can see it's classic corduroy, but I use this fun cat fabric for my pocket lining. 
So I really like using novelty fabric. Let me know the funnest, I know that's not a word, but it's fun to say. Let me know the funnest novelty fabric you've ever used and what you have used it on. Thanks so much for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye!